Hi, I'm Genesis Hay with Genesis Hay Productions, and we're working in conjunction with Dixon Main Street. This is our third segment of Main Street TV, where we highlight the businesses of downtown Dixon. Today, we're going to be going into the traditional wellness center, which also includes the ginkgo tree. Hi there, today we're with the ladies of the Ginkgo Tree Cafe, and ladies, you are truly an asset to the Dixon community. Can you Thank talk you. to us a little bit about some of the great things going on here? Well, we have four main areas of the traditional wellness center and Ginkgo Tree Cafe, including the tea shop, the retail center behind us, the uh, kitchen, and the upstairs and downstairs fitness centers. Well, wonderful. Well, we're looking forward to taking a look at all four of those places. So it looks like you've got all kinds of options for teas and delicious snacks. Can you tell us a little bit about some of the teas? Sure. The tea shop is the first thing you see when you enter the building here. So we have tons of different teas which you can buy by the cup or pot to have here or you can also buy in bulk to take home. And we have fresh baked goods made every day as well as locally roasted coffee and fresh baked bread. Yum. So tell us about this area. It looks like you've got all kinds of goodies and knickknacks available to people. This is our gift shop area where we feature local artist wares, um, all kinds of unique gift items from local soaps that are organically made in hand washes. We have jewelry and, uh, sorry, <laughs> and a little bit of everything it looks like. Pictures, soaps, purses, right. and you said you showcase or highlight a local artist. Yes, yeah, so right now we are um, kind of putting out their unique gift items for your Valentine different jewelry. We have these cute little uh, Valentine's knickknacks showing. Great. Well, let's check out the next spot. Okay. So where are we headed next? Next we're headed upstairs, which serves as both a rental space and for our classes, which include many yoga classes, meditation, and Tai Chi. Great. We had a lot of different types of things. So aside from all of those classes, looks like you've got a huge room to rent here. Yes, this is a beautiful room that is often rented out for baby showers or birthday parties. Kids love to run around up here in this huge space, so it serves well for that. And I've actually been to an event up here, and it's pretty amazing. Mm -hmm. You can bring people in from the outside, yeah. entertainment, music. Mm -hmm all of that sort of thing, so that's wonderful that you offer that. So where are we off to next? Next we are headed to the Ginkgo Tree Cafe Kitchen. All right. So we are in the Ginkgo Tree Cafe, and as you can see, Kathy is making up some wonderful breakfast here. Yes. It looks delicious. Yes, we, uh, we like to put it right in a pan, and it's just like home cooking. <laughs> we do everything from scratch, and a lot of times if we get real busy, we've got a big old griddle, we'll put it out there for a big breakfast day, but uh, right now we're making a beautiful scramble with fresh veggies, and then i got some fresh potatoes in here, and I'm making some uh, bacon, uh, bacon and eggs for a couple of our regular customers that, that call on us for breakfast. So. <laughs> Pretty often. Awesome. So that's what we're doing here. Yeah, it looks delicious, doesn't it? So I'm going to cover that and let the cheese melt a little bit while her bagel's cooking, and then um, throw these eggs in the pan for Mike. And so, what are some of the other options on the menu that somebody? Can Breakfast is great. We make biscuits and gravy from ground turkey, all kinds of great spices. The body of the gravy is made with a vegetable stock that we make ourselves. In fact, right there. Is the veggie pot. <laughs> we save all of our scraps from, you know, carrot tots, all that kind of thing, and then we um, make it into the veggie stock. And then, of course, there's some dairy and stuff in there, but um, it's delicious over whole wheat biscuits. Our casseroles are awesome right now. It's an Italian inspired squash, yellow squash, a little bit of ham, uh, some, some gorgonzola cheese. Comes in a nice pie slice of casserole. Um, we serve that with our homemade bran muffins. And uh, what else for breakfast? Paninis. Breakfast paninis are a big hit. Right now we have pear, brie, bacon. And then oh there's like a, maybe a cinnamon and a brown sugar spice in there. <laughs> and everything's served with a beautiful fresh fruit every day. So if you're not coming here, you're missing out. Yeah. That's everything's whole say. foods and fresh, fresh as it can be. And that's, uh, I think, we've got the corner of the market on that in town. Yeah. We're really, we're really, uh, we think that sets us apart a bit. Absolutely. You should, you should uh, have Laura tell you what's in these soups okay. when she gets back from the fridge. <laughs> yeah, Laura, tell us about these soups over here. Well, we have, today we're having chili con carne and um, a sweet potato um, ginger with tofu. Mm. We get the ladles here. The tofu's not in this one yet, but... Um, 
And what I love so much about your food is that it's just so healthy. You know, when you taste it. Yeah, we try to use every drink day. and eat it. It's just, oh my gosh, it's wonderful. It tastes good. Fresh. It's good for you. What more could you want? It's growing right here in Lee County. Yep, and this will be tomorrow's soup. And um, yummy. We um, are so good. We just try to keep it as simple and fresh and whole foods as we can. It was good. Talk about your sweet potato that you, your loaded sweet potato that we did with oh, the beans. Oh yeah, we had a baked sweet potato, and then I made some smoky black-eyed peas with some other sautéed seasoned sautéed some other stuff together with it, and then we had it like kind of a stuffed baked potato. Okay. With, with uh, the wilted greens on the side. Yep. Now, do you ladies have a special of the day? Is there a special every single day, or do you just yes. really do? I, I know that you're. Your menu changes from time to time. Whatever we're in the mood for. <laughs> yeah. Well, we because sometimes we try to use seasonal mm -hmm. and um, fresh local as much as we can. Um, it just it's whatever is in season, we try to have a special that incorporates whatever is local. Like some names, we'll just have a fresh sandwich, a different a different panini that's not on uh -huh. our menu. Sometimes we will have. Like a like yesterday, we'll have a pasta dish or something like that, mm -hmm. or sometimes we'll have roast pork. You know, sounds good. It's good. Well, thank you so much, ladies. It looks absolutely delicious. You gotta come in and check them out. Yep. Please do. <laughs> thank you so much for being with us today on this segment of Main Street TV. We are located at 216 West First Street, and again, it's the traditional wellness center.